I am so excited and humbled to chat with you both today because, I mean, this is history making stuff we're talking about right here. I mean, this is so <laughs> amazing. What has this journey been like for you to kind of come into your own in the WWE and now put yourself out there as the fabulous person that you are? It's been, I think, really cool for me personally to be able to kind of become more comfortable with myself while sharing that journey with everyone watching because I wasn't comfortable with my sexuality seven and a half years ago when I came out. It was kind of like a nerve wracking on the whim experience. So it's kind of forced me or pressured me to be okay with myself because I started seeing all these stories of people now seeing what I did and they wanted to do the same and kind of looking up to me. So I was like, I need to step up and, and live and breathe what I'm preaching. And so it kind of forced me to step up and be comfortable with myself. and. I think it happened the best way because I don't know um, how much longer I would have delayed that process had this not happened. Tony, I got to say, I'm a little <laughs> jealous. You get to be the right hand man. You get to be the other oh my God. of this dynamic <laughs> I know. duo. Like, what has this been like for you to just go on this journey with Sonia and enjoy just being together with her? Oh, it's been absolutely unreal. We still get into bed every night and we're like, how is this our life? Like, yeah. how did this happen? It still feels like a dream. We both like admired each other from afar via Instagram for years. Like, I feel like I'm dating my best friend. I feel like I didn't know what love was until I met her. It's just like, it's so easy and it's so right. Yes, and I have to imagine, Sonia, like having somebody like her by your side, it's probably made you feel that much more comfortable to accept yourself, to put yourself out there in this platform because you have this rock star right by your side that makes you feel more fulfilled as an individual. A hundred percent. I always tell her like, I'm the best version of me when I'm with her. Um, and I never knew I could be so at peace with myself and so, just content and happy, um, but finding Tony and like finding the dynamic and the partnership that we have has allowed me to feel more confident and more accepting of myself in so many ways that I didn't even realize prior. I love that, thank you. And Tony, let me ask you a similar question. Like, how does Sonia add so much to your life? We know she's a great star, big personality, but when it comes to that personal connection that you two have, how does she light up your life? Oh my God, in every way. But she's, I think the biggest thing, she's like so motivating. She wants you to feel so good and whatever you want to go after, she is like, let's it, let's do it. We're all in. Even as a woman, um, you know, LGBTQ aside, like as a woman, I want women to watch what we do and be like, I can do anything, I can do that. And they're, you know, hopefully we're breaking it down and making some of these goals more tangible for people watching and learning. So that's kind of the goal. Um, but yeah, just being kind of that representation that I didn't see on TV when I was, you know, 12, 13, 14, 15 years old, um, coming from a super small town too. The more we can put it out there to fully like be accepting of whoever you really feel like you are at a younger age, I think that's like a really important thing for us to help get across to the younger generation. 100%. Like just self-acceptance all around. One of my favorite quotes I'll end with is be yourself because everyone else is already taken. And I absolutely love that quote because it's like, when you stop living in comparison to other people around you and you start realizing that you are created as this unique individual and you're supposed to play this role in life and, and do whatever it is that you believe in and put your imprint on the world, your blueprint. Enjoy being you because there's only one of you. But do it when it feels right and know that when you do do it, there's nothing wrong with it. And it's actually a beautiful thing to be able to say, this is who I am.